how to feel to you know, get in there and, and uh, have your you know, number called and come through a couple times on big plays? Uh, it felt real good, actually. Uh, I think Coach Adams and uh, Matt, they do a good job uh, of, like you said, the back of our receivers. Just being ready, uh, you never know when your moment's going to be like come. You never know like when the ball can come your way. So they just do a good job while it's like in practice, just making sure like we take them reps, take them serious as game reps. So when it gets to the actual game, that it actually just comes all easy. Did, did you have any idea going into the game that you might have a little bit bigger role or get a chance to go out there? Uh, yeah, uh, in the game plan this week, uh, we uh, practiced and repped it out a lot. So I kind of had a good feeling that the ball would probably come my way. And, but, uh, you know, I just didn't overthink it, just uh, catch the ball first, and then just after that, it all come natural. How difficult has it been to, to have to wait this long to, you know, be ready, you know, feel like probably you were ready to go at the beginning of the season and, and not have a lot of opportunities? Uh, I, it, it felt good, but um, just really patience is key. Uh, it didn't really matter to me, really. Uh, I know uh, I have three great players in front of me, and uh, I look up to those guys a lot, so it didn't really matter to me at all. Um, it was just actually happy that they actually worked with me and worked they all worked with all of us and just make sure that we are ready for when that time does come. Which position are you playing? Uh, X. Um, and uh, you know, going into the game, did you have you know five plays or ten plays or kind of a limited number, or did you have are you ready to do whatever, or how did they kind of get you ready for it? Uh, well, since I've been here, I've been switched around a lot at all the uh, positions, so uh, I guess that actually comes in handy a lot because I, I know all the positions, so. You never know, like you said, uh, Adam's gonna, uh, you can throw me in at any position and I'll just know it. So I just had to be ready for that. What was it like to uh, do, do your first collegiate reception in a game? And I know probably most people envision, you know, a, a wide open touchdown catch or something like that. But I think it was a you know, tough catch on third third down that moved the chains. <laughs> no, I'm thankful for uh, my first college catch. Uh, it actually meant a lot to me. Uh, I know despite the loss, but uh, I don't know. It's always just great to look back on that you had your first uh, college catch, your uh, redshirt freshman year. So that was actually kind of big for me. How important, I mean, are, are the opportunities when they come your way? And I, I know you've gotten, you played some snaps this year, but mostly it kind of seems like you're in run blocking plays or something like that. So to get a ball thrown your way, how, how important is that production and those limited opportunities? Uh, it's actually real big. Uh, it says, uh, I think, you know, they trusted me more. Uh, I know they trust me on the field, so it's just good. I just got to keep that trust and just uh, keep working my way into it. You guys have, you know, coming into the year, there was so much talk about the, the depth you guys could have at wide receiver, and we haven't really seen it much. And Harsano said yesterday, we're going to start to see it more. You, you guys feel like those opportunities are coming? And maybe it's going to start to change a little bit? Uh, yeah, of course it is. Um, like you said, uh, there's just so many things that we have and, like, so many great players that can play so many like, different ways. So it's actually uh, it's actually kind of special to see like the what we have in that room really. So uh, I'm looking forward to it to see. What do you learn from Spurback and Shane and, and Chaz? <laughs> what, what do you take from those guys? Uh, just um, just the uh, just the way in, like in practice what they do. You know how they handle and stuff um, isn't going well. Really, that's the big thing. Uh, that's really you know most people like you said I like played besides this year since high school. So you know. Usually when you're coming from like being like the man at that school now to like the little person, you have to like look up to them type people and like see from a different level. Like this is a whole different game than just high school. So it's like bigger like on and off the field. You, you had to wait for so long to play college football. How, you know, what's the feeling been like just, just being out there and just being in games again? Uh, I'm just enjoying it really. Uh, you know, going out here with uh, all these fans, is, it's actually kind of crazy every time. I always try to like say I'm not nervous and everything like that until like we actually get out there. I'm like, all right, like, <laughs> this is something else. But I mean, I actually it seems I, like you know maybe most snaps you got in a game this year is maybe, maybe ten or so or five to ten somewhere in that range. So your heart still beat a little bit when you get out there? Uh, not really it, how it used to. Like the first two games, my first away game and first home game, that's when I was like, oh, like I don't know how this is gonna go. But as like I said, as the games kept going on. And as I, just, uh, as I just kept playing, it just more kind of got easier. And uh, the game's slowing down way more, which I really like about it. So just uh, being out there is really helping me. What have you guys uh, been able to do to maybe, to maybe earn more reps? And I'm talking about you, know, you Sean Modster, and Akeelian Butler. Cause it's, I mean, obviously, that, I would assume it comes from practice. But uh, you guys are definitely getting on the field more so now than, than you were earlier in the year. Uh, just, you know, uh, Shane, Chaz, and Spurbeck, you know, they just make a lot of plays. And, you know, uh, sometimes they just get tired and, you know, you just got to be there to, like, help them out, really. So, like, just 
really, um, it just goes off, like you said, consistency in practice, really, so coaches can see that, really. So you can go in there and they don't have to like worry about like if you're in the game or not. I know that you guys are obviously going to feel here you know, in a little bit or whatnot, but it, it, emphasis on putting the ball away again, is there anything that you guys are maybe maybe doing a little different this week or is it is it just going to be like any other week? Or? Uh, no, you know, we're just going to keep it how every other week is. Every week I think we prep real um, good, you know, just want to know mentality. We just uh, focus on the team that we're playing like this week. So, you know, uh, I really don't expect nothing much big, like you said. We stress that every week, in, uh, every like practice that we have. So it's, it shouldn't be none different. Have you been, you know, feel like you've been getting better over the last six or seven weeks, maybe behind the scenes and, and things you're doing? Or, I mean, you feel progress, even though you didn't have a chance to show it out on the field as much? Oh, yeah, way more, uh, much progress. You know, just uh, so much reps that we get in practice. So, like, when you come in, like you said, when you come in the game, really, it all comes natural because you've been going over and over it so much. And then even just like, on and off the field, like when we're not really practicing, we, uh, players do like a good job of like just coming in, working out, just getting better. So uh, we just want to um, hone our craft really and just um, show it. Cool. Uh, Coach was saying there's you know there's really only one stat that you guys keep track of, and that's the turnovers, or at least I think he said that he puts it in the locker room or whatnot. Is that the case? And do you guys pass that this week at all? And does it, does it, does it sting a little more or sink in a little bit more or anything like that? Um, I mean, of course, like I said, the um, last game did kind of hurt. It hurt to us, had to swallow, really. Um, but you just got to learn from it, really. I like um, coaches say, football really humbles you. And it, um, on, like I said, it teaches you about life. So like you said, I know we had like a, a good little winning streak going and everything, but you just got to face adversity and um, just continue on with it.